The Democratic lobbying group Progress Action Fund recently debuted what may be the most risque ad in an effort to urge Ohio voters to vote no on a Republican proposed constitutional amendment up for a vote in August that could impact efforts to grant further access to abortion in the state of Ohio. Do you have a condom? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, you can't use those. What are you talking about? Who are you? I'm your Republican congressman. Now that we're in charge, we're banning birth control. This is our decision, not yours. Get out of our bedroom. I won the last election. I'm not going anywhere. I'm just going to watch and make sure you don't do anything illegal. Acting's not great, but it's... <laughs> <laughs> That's it's, what you were focused on. But, but I, 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 I'm looking at this and I'm thinking, you know, the great moment at the beginning, right, with the hot steamy and then... I was thinking, oh, the, the actors are really, you know, it feels like they maybe did this on a sort of volunteer basis. <laughs> <laughs> all, all I know is we have a special election coming up in Ohio as an Ohio yeah. resident. Yes, uh, that's what, they're, that's what and, this and is about. We're trying, we're trying to uh, uh, prevent them making it harder to amend the state constitution because what they fear, the conservatives in Ohio fear, is that, as has happened in other states, the, there will be a, a, an amendment to the Constitution of Ohio, state constitution, that the, the fear is that they will make it harder to amend the Constitution. Right. So, amend the Constitution it, to protect six, abortion rights. It's a six-week right. uh, fetal heartbeat bill. So, we, yes, to make it more, more liberal, more. I am scared to death that some old man, Right. Like that guy? To, like that guy <laughs> is going to tell my 17-year-old what she can or can't do. That's my job as her father and her mother's job. It's not a politician stranger's job to come in and say you can't have an abortion. It, she, she controls her body, not that guy. That ad is very effective to me because I look at that and I say, oh, my God, they're absolutely right. That guy's going to be symbolically in a lot of bedrooms. And here's what people don't realize, is that Geraldo is actually, by number of years, older than that guy. Uh, he, just, he just doesn't, he just, he just doesn't look, he just, he doesn't look older, but, but Geraldo is actually older. Uh, Kieran Chetri, if, oh, go ahead, Tracy, effective? Well, I was going to say, they yeah. made a big mistake. Stay out of this fight. Like Geraldo said, this is not the old white guy's decision at the end of the day. And if there were people on the right who were on the fence... They may not be there anymore. Right. This is the great danger, exactly. right, for the right, is in the national uh, election in 24, is the concern that this becomes a bigger issue than I think the right would like it to be. Well, the right took a hit, you know, in the midterms on yeah. the abortion issue. Um, I, but I do think that the majority of Americans, if you're talking about what the majority of Americans do, want some limits placed on abortion. But some is uh, not. Well, what some I'm, mean? Of course I mean, you don't I'm, want not gonna define, I'm not going to define. I'm not going to define that. But look, if, it would be more effective if you want to go like the Clinton route where Safe, effective, rare. You know, um, like the 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 optics don't seem to be that we don't want. Um, but you don't. We, we want to prevent more than we want to expand abortion rights. We want to prevent abortion. But like Geraldo, I worry that w if it goes bad, then my where are my daughters going? To some butcher yeah. in a basement? Uh, yeah. That can't but, happen. But I'll, I'll get arrested driving her into Pennsylvania right. at the state line there. It's, it's absolutely preposterous. Right. But, but let me ask you. And, that, and they did lose. And, and abortion is the biggest issue in the country, I think. Really? Just like it was in the midterms. I don't it think it's be, It will be again. The, when those independents, the suburban women, are, are in the ballot box, they're going to say, do you want... Uh, you know, Ron DeSantis or someone like him or Donald, do you want them in charge of your daughter? It's going to be very effective. I, I, think, I think the reason it was more effective in 22 than it may be in 24 is that it came on the heels of the opinion uh, by the Supreme Court. And I think that the Democrats did a very good job of overstating the impact that it would have, meaning the notion that it doesn't happen in every state, right? It is going, it has fundamentally changed abortion access in a number of states but not across the country. And the question becomes, in those battleground states, what is the particular law? How important is that of an issue to people in that particular state? I, I think state? women are very I, motivated. I, I think practically speaking, I'm, I, I don't, I, I, it's a way bigger issue politi politically than practically. Because of the in majority, terms of people or, voting on majority of, um, of abortions are, are medical, are, you know, are pill form. What happens it's, when they go after that? Isn't that the next... Frontier? It's just the, the whole and notion. Interstate travel? Well, I mean, the, the, it's still the doctor 
the doctor's discretion with the patient when it comes to the majority, the majority of abortions. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your cable provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.